Everyone has a passion for their life, something they really love or want to become. For you, that may be nursing or it may be rapping for somebody else. Maybe it's professional sleeping, underwater pizza delivery, if that's what you're into. But all of that aside, we all have things that we love and we all have a vision for ourselves. For me, that started when I was in preschool and kindergarten. I dreamt of becoming a professional snowboarder briefly and more so than snowboarding, becoming an inventor who would create the next million dollar product and revolutionize technology forever. But that eventually just passed along with the wind and throughout my latter years in elementary school, I hoped to become a comic book artist. I sketched out original cartoons and characters that I saw on Cartoon Network and other channels. I couldn't draw to save my life, and I still can't, but I was a bound and determined third through fifth grader who wasn't going to let anything get in his way. But again, those dreams simply moved on as my interests changed, and as I slowly realized that I couldn't even draw a decent stick figure. Through my middle school years, I came to the conclusion that I wanted to be an engineer and that MIT would make some big exception for me. Even though I knew nothing about engineering, what an engineer does, or MIT's acceptance rate, which is a whopping 4.3%. When I crossed the bridge into high school, I finally came to that realization, and honestly, it scared me a lot. Guidance counselors were coming into the classrooms talking about college, and while everyone around me knew what they wanted in the future, I had no idea. It freaked me out. I had researched JMU a lot, went on a tour, and I really liked what they had to offer, but I still didn't have a real path to follow. But then I had an awakening of sorts. In reality, it was more of a slow realization, but nonetheless, I grasped that my biggest real passion was staring me dead in the face, singing. And I had just been too scared to go after it. But in life, you have to do something you really love, otherwise you'll always be unfulfilled. One just has to be bold and get after that thing in their life. So with that said, next year I plan to go to James Madison University with a major in vocal music education to become a choir director one day. And I've never been more content with my future than I am right now. That's basically all I got. But if there's one thing I want you to take away from this video, it's that you don't need to know what you want to do with your life yet. It takes time. But if there's something in your life that you're really passionate about, I encourage you to chase after that. It may be more achievable than you think. Thank you.